So when you buy a property in an area where there's a lot of high-risk tenants, you want to lower your risk, mitigate your risk as much as possible. And if you buy it rent ready and vacant, you have the opportunity to do that because you have the opportunity to professionally screen the tenants to your standards. My opinion, the best type of tenants for properties in these kinds of neighborhoods are going to be your government guaranteed tenants. When you have a government guaranteed tenant, folks, you get a Section 8 tenant in there, you ain't got no problem collecting your $9.50 a month per unit, right? When you go cash paying tenants in sketchy neighborhoods, then it becomes a problem. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show. Folks, thing is selling at or above list. We are gonna provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. Mind blowing, man. That is the term that comes to my mind when I discuss the Section 8 numbers we are still seeing in the Cleveland market today in 2024. Check this out. 10315 Elliott, okay? This is a duplex coming to you completely turnkey, ready to go, ready to rent, lead certified, ready to rock and roll, 79900 okay? And we are coming out with a market rent of $1,900 per month. This is my favorite way to buy a property, especially a property like this in a very challenging neighborhood, okay? And that is rent ready, but vacant, right? Especially when you're in a tough neighborhood. When you're in a tough neighborhood, folks, what is the biggest risk? What is the biggest issue? The biggest issue is tenants giving you a hard time, whether that be uh, tenants who don't pay rent, tenants who screw up your house, tenants who make your life miserable, etc. right? So when you buy a property in an area where there's a lot of high-risk tenants, you want to lower your risk, mitigate your risk as much as possible. And if you buy it rent ready and vacant, you have the opportunity to do that because you have the opportunity to professionally screen the tenants to your standards, right? You could run the business how you want as opposed to running the business how the previous landlord was running it. And i.e., folks, let's, you know, put two and two together here. If the previous landlord's selling, they probably weren't that great at running the business or they'd continue running the business based on how good these numbers are, right? So you do run considerable risk when you go with a property with inherited tenants. We're eliminating all that here for you with this opportunity. My opinion, the best type of tenants for properties in these kinds of neighborhoods are going to be your government guaranteed tenants. When you have a government guaranteed tenant, folks, you get a Section 8 tenant in there, you ain't got no problem collecting your $9.50 a month per unit, right? When you go cash paying tenants in sketchy neighborhoods, then it becomes a problem. Then you have the opportunity to end up on the Tenants from Hell show here on Holton Wise TV. And let me tell you, folks, if you're the landlord, you don't want your property to pop up on the Tenants from Hell show on Holton Wise TV. That's the most popular content we publish, right? And we publish it everywhere. We publish it on all the platforms, right? The YouTube, TikTok, Twitter, uh, Instagram, right? Everywhere, okay? And people love watching that. They salivate over that stuff because it's, it's, it's like watching a car wreck, honestly. I mean, we actually do have a car wreck on there. We literally had uh, some freaking person high on fentanyl smash into one of our houses one time, right? It's all crazy, right? You don't want to be the person that owns the house in those situations. And I'll tell you what. Probably about 90, maybe 95% of those situations, folks, involve inherited tenants. So when you have the opportunity to professionally screen, you really eliminate a lot of your risks. And that's what you're getting here today with this particular property. Ready to rock. All you got to do is put your own tenants in there. Now, I want you guys to stick around to the end of the video because, you know, obviously we've been playing you some footage uh, of the property as I've been talking to you. But what you're going to get if you stick around to the end of the video is the complete uh, video tour, right? The footage that we've been chopping up here and showing you, you're going to get to see the whole thing with audio completely uncut from when my guys uh, went out to that property. So stay tuned. Um, and then to make an offer on this particular property, just send us an email, sales at holtonwise.com. You want to pay cash? That's cool with me, man. Just let me know how much you want to pay and show me your proof of funds. If you want to finance it, awesome. Give me your pre-approval letter. If you don't have one, you need a lender. Well, you bet your booty, man. I got one for you. I got a whole bunch of lenders, right? You guys could be local to Ohio, 
to Cleveland. You guys can be out-of-state investors. You guys can be out-of-country investors. It's fine with me. I got lenders for all of you. I've been doing this for friggin' 15 years, y'all. I got a Rolodex of lenders uh, ready for you guys, ready to rock and roll. Uh, wherever you are, right? My my lenders want to work with investors, and you guys know the rates are dropping quickly. Okay, Fed also announced another like five or six rate cuts are planned to happen. So now is definitely the time to jump. The numbers speak for themselves. Sales at HoltonWines.com. Also, too, if you'd like to tour it yourself, even though we're going to give you all that detail in the video tour here in a second, but if you want to tour it with your own eyeballs, that's great, man. Shoot me an email. I'll get you in there. You hit us up before 5 o'clock. We'll get you in there. Same business day. Stay tuned for the unedited tour right now. Smoke detector. Why is there a smoke detector outside, dude? I mean, it's a lock box. You can go up by that. This is a single family, right? Looks like that shit that's at sheets. It is outside. Oh, fuck. Well, we're going in here. I don't know if you want to put the sign in here. I was wondering, too, if maybe uh, if those windows are open, you can hang out in the front. You can put one there and one up there. Why not? We only got one side. Oh, I, oh, I thought you said we only had one side. Mm -mm. Oh. I only got one lock. We only got one lockbox. Oh. Lockbox is on this side door, by the way, too. Well, this is kind of in a dope spot. It's got a abandoned lot next door. Yeah. This must kind of be a good spot. Yeah. Like that was kind of cool. Oh, there's another couple tires. There's about a dozen tires over there. Good news, side door was locked this time. Always makes me feel a little better when the place is actually locked up when you show up. Yeah, at least these at least these ones people got rid of at the right time. Like that? Yeah, why not? Alright, see if they can get us inside this place. of the front and maybe do that 360 in the neighborhood but you're not getting back there I don't think it's even worth that dude with all the power lines and trees and bullshit I can be you <clears throat> plus it was being real real weird the last time I was using it any, any amount of wind it was like 
And immediately. For real, what the hell is that thing? Bugs. Dude, it's the same thing from sheets. You know what I'm talking about? Where are we looking That's what thing? that is? It's a bug thingy? I'm assuming. It's not doing a good fucking job. But... What? Yeah, right? Hey, it's made by our friends in Taiwan. Taiwan. No, oh, bro, come on. It's coming from down the hill, don't worry. It's not inside. What, uh, <laughs> what school was that? Uh, that's a drum line. Or the band, marching band, whatever you want to call it. They don't work? What in the fuck is going on? You gotta be. You wanna try a different door? <laughs> try this front door that's really not locked at all. There's a back door, too. Wait, that's not locked? No. I can see it's not closed all the way. We're gonna fucking open it. It's gonna hit that beehive. Don't, just don't swing it open like an asshole. <laughs> I'm gonna. This is lost. Does it work? No. Although, this is a good opportunity for me to get a close up on that hornet's nest. Yeah, and you, well, know, uh, you, know, you, know, you don't need to get close. <laughs> Suckers. Take out my nine million. Huh, maybe. Maybe somebody's home. Ha! <laughs> huh. You mean tell me he We're in? Does that mean we should move uh, the lock box back here? Nope. Let them figure it out just like we had to. <laughs> well, this wasn't locked, so if anybody locks this up, they're fucked. Hello? Man, he's eager. Yeah. Was the interior door locked at least? Yeah, that's what he's Oh, okay. Fucking spiders all over this. It's pretty cool. My shots. Oh, okay. This is a common area. That makes sense. Yeah. Huh? I mean, nothing bad I can say about this place. It's nice. Each crank up to 80, that's great. Yeah, it's actually pretty good shape. Yeah, I kind of hate that. <laughs> I don't hate it. Vince, did you go downstairs? Okay, just making sure. I don't want to scare you by. No, oh, we're good. New furnace, new water tanks. New, new gas water. meters. Well, one new, new gas meter. Brand new gas meters. Although oh, this one took a shit. That one's leaking on the bottom. Or one of them is, I don't know. Unless the chimney has a leak somewhere. So they are down one water tank. I bet it's this one. Brand new filter. You see how it's wet on me? Yeah.
Where are the panels? Did you say over there? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I saw that. Well, the one to the right is brand new. Look, it's still shiny and everything. Why didn't they take that? I don't know. What the heck? The Dominion, maybe Dominion? Yeah, Dominion. Let's go upstairs. Up, up, up and away. Hey, Derek. Are you upstairs, Derek? Oh, Derek. Yeah. We are on our way up. Well, come on up. How is it? Oh, my goodness, it looks kind of like the same. Yeah. This is like rent ready. Close to it? Yeah. You yeah, don't open that, I'm not going up there. It's hot as fuck. <laughs> Sweat my nuts off up here, dude. It's hot. Creepy. You can't see shit in here, but that's the finished part. So far, should be finished. Kind of tough to get down these steps, though. Shit, it's hot there. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.